Polish member of the European Parliament has written to the European Commission expressing outrage at a Paris state-funded museum exhibiting an exhibition which, he claims, glorifies Palestinian suicide bombers. This is the catalogue of the exhibition, which shows the work of Palestinian photographer Alham Shibli, who claims that they document Palestinians' lives living under oppression. Every photograph is accompanied by a description of the subject and the circumstances in which they were taken. I'm really concerned about uh, photographs of uh, suicide bombers who are portrayed during this, ex uh, during this ex exhibition as a freedom fighters. In my opinion, they are ruthless terrorists who are killing innocent Israeli citizens and they are not, they, they not deserve to be portrayed as a freedom fighters because they are not freedom fighters, they are terrorists. And what reaction have you had to your complaint? Uh, I'm still waiting for an uh, answer from the European Commission. Uh, the Commission has a couple of weeks to answer my question and it's only uh, seven days when I send it, so I'm still waiting for an answer. But I received a very uh, mm, a good support from the uh, Jewish and not only Jewish community in Europe uh, for my letter and for raising this question. It's a question of real political freedom. Voltaire, who is a French, it's a French exhibition, said, I don't share your opinion, but I will do everything to make it possible that you ex can express your opinion. And I think, therefore, the French authorities will be wise enough in the spirit of Voltaire of saying, thanks for your contribution, but this has to be shown because it's arts and people have to see what is behind. I don't think that it's a freedom of expression. It's rather a propaganda of a terrorist act. I'm a defender of freedom of speech. But we have in European law, we have, for example, uh, in Poland, uh, and as far as I know in German and in France, uh, the sanction against the Holocaust deniers. And uh, they cannot defend themselves that it's a freedom of speech. I think that the number of crimes which were committed against the Jewish people in Europe allows us to be very sensitive about uh, portraying the people who are killing Jewish people as a freedom fighters because as I said they are not freedom fighters and I don't think that the freedom of speech is a freedom to promote violence and to promote uh, terrorism. The museum has strongly defended its decision to stage the exhibit saying that the captions accompanying the pictures do not represent the views of the museum but are the words of Shibley herself. The French Ministry of Culture defended the right of the museum to host the exhibit, but also said it poses an important question. What is the limit of freedoms to artistic expression? This is Colin Stevens at the European Parliament in Brussels.